Mr. Oreo. Hi, Oreos. Oreo in the window. <laughs> Hello, my friends, and welcome back. It is Sunday, July 16th, 2023. I'm the Drunk Pokeroo. Tis beer time. Took a little road trip today, me and Mr. Poker, like, sitting around, like, yesterday we were just trapped in the house because it was raining all day. Let's go somewhere. So we get on the road, and she's like, where are we going? I'm like, there's only one place we're going. Turd Moon. We're going Turd Moon, baby. Uh, they just re-released Milton Dew, which Mrs. Polk loves. And they had two new IPAs, and I'm like, you never, you know, we've never sat there and had a beer. So we went and had a beer. I had uh, Left Hand, uh, the Left Hand Stout, no, sorry, Left Hand uh, West Coast IPA. Um, very, such a good beer. I'm looking forward to that series as we go along. They had a couple new things to pick up, and we got some more Milton Dew for Mrs. Polk and Bone Tree for me, because that might be the beer of the year. Or Bone Pine, sorry, Bone Pine. Uh, that's the mix-up of, you know, Lone Pine and Bone Tree. And we got this one. Let's start here. We're Waka Hops and Nelson Savant. This is a big old New Zealand hop puncher, 6.5. Where Waka comes from the uh, Saz line of hops, which is interesting. So you're going to get some spicy characters out of that. Um, I love it. I love the Third Moon vibe. I love the, the, the crowd in there was really like such a varied group of people. And it was great to see. Um, they have a Pills on tap if you're just looking for a beer that tastes like a beer. So they got a little bit of everything. They got Slushy Machine. Mrs. Polk had two beer slushies. With one with Milton Dew and one with Milton Dew Blood Red. So, I mean, that was good, too. Let's get into this. Cheers, my friends. Uh, to random roadies. Now you got beers for the pool. Cheers. So, they love using the oats, right? To get it, like, that smooth, nice and soft body. And that's beautiful. And you do get this big grapefruit citrusy punch up front. Um, there is this little bit of noble hop spice in there. When you get these creamy beers, though, right, everything is kind of just this big, flowy kind of feeling, and it's very good. And with the Nelson Savant in there, too, you're getting a little bit of berry, some white grape. Um, it's really good. It's excellent again, 6'5". I don't care. <laughs> right? You're like, ah, eh, does the ABV even matter anymore? Is it cumulative or exponential? Nobody can ever tell me that. Right? Does it add up? Or does it, you know, do you multiply? I'm not sure what's happening. It's really good. It's so smooth, too, eh? They've, they've nailed that kind of texture in these beers, these big, hazy IPAs. But yeah, it does have a, a, a nice bit of kick on the back. I'm really impressed with that because it's this white uh, grapefruit pith and then this kind of spicy noble hop spice. That's really good. That's interesting. It's different. And once again, it's another fantastic beer from our pals at Third Moon. So lots going on out there in Milton. The bottle shop is now open Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. Because usually they were open Thursday to Sunday, right? The bottle shop and the brewery, like where you can sit down and have a pint. But they've decided for the summer, they're going to be open Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. So if you're out in Milton Way on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, you can stop in and grab some bottles and cans to go. So you're in good shape for that, right? So that poke, Poke's always looking out for you guys. I'm, I'm going to go jump in the pool. I hope you have a wonderful Sunday. we got lots to talk about this week. It's going to be an interesting week, to say the least, but uh, I'm here for the beer. Cheers. It's a beautiful drive out to Milton, too, if you want to go. Like, it just, everything works out the way it's supposed to work out, doesn't it? 